is up guys? Steve here. Got my girl from Brandlin. What's up? So right now we are currently at this place called Gallwood Cemetery. Now there's a lot of history that goes along with all these acres of land around us right now. So there was a family called the Gall family that actually bought these acres of land when they came here and ended up somehow getting kicked out of the town that they resided in, losing all their acres of land and ended up out in these woods that are surrounding us right now and dying off one by one. And they say that they haunt these woods till today. So we're here to check this out and I hope you guys are ready for this adventure because we about to go get it. Alright guys, we are back and we are currently about to walk down this path in these woods that actually looks pretty cool but cre pretty creepy at the same time. Check this out. And we have to travel through these woods just to get to the cemetery. It seems like every place we hit, you gotta go through a path of woods. <laughs> Remember what I said in the last video, guys, how she always manages to get me out in the scary woods? Well, this is living proof and example. <laughs> like, look at that. That's where we parked at over here. They said that the, uh, that the gull's house is actually still in these woods, too which we want to actually sometime get permission to go inside that house. And it's very, very cold. <laughs> yeah, as you guys can see, leaves are changing. Wonderful state of Ohio. <laughs> Can't wait to move to Florida. Look at that tree, that's weird. For some reason Brandolin always has these infatuations with trees like that's the first thing no matter where we go it's either she's got to hit a button on a wall or she's got to be touching a tree or something I don't know if that's like some kind of weird fetish you know girls have or what no just mine it's pretty and like she said guys I mean they say it is guaranteed haunted so if you guys see anything, definitely comment down below and let us know. And if we get a lot of likes, comments, and subscribes, we will come back at night. We do got to find a parking spot for nobody else sees it. So how many likes you want them to do? Mm, 23,000. 23? Why couldn't it have been an even number? <laughs> I don't know. She had to go with 23,000, guys. <laughs> so like she said, 23,000 likes. And we will come here at night time but the thing is is you better make sure you give us some 23 likes we won't do it otherwise because we actually got to find a place to park around here to Pretty actually be here we have to actually sneak to actually do a video here but there are stories too about people that hike these trails in these woods that would hike and walk past the cemetery that we're going to right now that you would actually see these balls of light zigzagging on top of the graves and there is supposed to be one black tombstone in this cemetery that is warm to the touch so we're definitely going to try to find that one and see how hot it actually is and if the stories are actually true we got brandolin for a shirt girl she walks pretty fast But guys, we're going to walk a little bit farther in these woods. And once we get a little closer, we will start this video back up. See you then. So we were walking towards the cemetery. We found the house that the Gall family lived in. <laughs> <laughs> Check this out. The oh. windows are boarded up and everything. You can obviously see they got a sign there that says restricted area, guys. It makes me, it makes me so tempted to want to see it, but, oh, I never, I didn't even see that. It's like a barn? Yeah, right to their house. Yeah, guys, there's a barn over there in the middle of the woods. I wish there was no trespassing sign, because I really, really want to go 
check it out. Yeah. And look, there's even a mailbox that says Gull Woods. But they say that it's the uh, office, but why would they have windows boarded up in the house if it was an office? I don't know. Maybe the office is... Maybe there's another building over there or something. Yeah. Maybe they don't use the actual house. I wonder if there's a trail that actually goes to that barn. Good question. If we find a trail that gives, lets us at least go closer up to the barn for you guys can see better, we definitely will take that trail. Definitely. <laughs> All right. We'll continue this up when we get straight to the cemetery. See you then. So we didn't find a trail. So we're making our own trail, <laughs> just for you guys can get that view. I'm gonna go check out this barn for you guys. And maybe a closer view towards the house too. Hey, it just said no trespassing on the driveway. <laughs> All these sticks and everything. So can you guys believe that the woods that we're walking in right now is the one where the whole Gall family died off? What if they died like right by their home? That's, that's the crazy part. It's so sad though, knowing that you got kicked out of a town. Well, and back then, you know, when you when when you actually get kicked out, I mean, you you don't have nowhere to go. You know, they probably didn't know where to go, so they went to the woods. And you know, you, here we get bad winters and couldn't find no food. I wonder if they pass in the summer or in the winter. That's, that would really suck in the winter. I probably both. Because it gets really really cold. I told you guys she always has me going on these adventures in woods. <laughs> Hopefully I don't get poison oak. I'm not really good for it. Lucky you. <laughs> oh, swamp. Well, it did used to be a swamp too when the government actually took over you guys. Um, they drained it for people can come here. Oh, there's a lot of weeds over there. I didn't even notice that. I would have kept walking. <laughs> <laughs> Ow! It's like pokey branches. Yeah. You guys can see it. I don't know if you guys can. What do you guys think? You guys think it's haunted? You guys think some of the golf families in there? Or maybe we can do a rating if we get close enough. You want to try that? Yeah. If it's locked, guys, we definitely can go inside or even risk it. Out of respect, and we don't want to go to jail. <laughs> that is not on my to-do list. <laughs> he's always mad at me because I like to say I want to check it out, and he's like, "I'm not going to jail with this so you no know, trespassing," which I don't blame him. He's a smart one. Ooh, there looks like we can get closer, and it looks really old. Yeah, I know. I think there's, I think I see another house. Do ya? Yeah. I hope it's not like somebody's random house, but I there's doubt it was. Oh! You see it? Yeah. I see those two houses over here. Well, I know their kids lived here too. Maybe this one of them was the kid. Maybe that was the actual parents of the Gauls. And the kids' house is back here. Looks like we're getting closer. What? <laughs> Don't scare me like that. I want to keep my leg. I hope not. I kind of don't want to find out either. I didn't really have to worry about it because I would have thrown you for bait. Hey! Hey, sir. Don't take me. Oh my god, you guys. I know. Makes you curious. So we keep walking. <laughs> There's a log there. Oh geez, thanks for letting me know that. <laughs> oh, I'm 
Ooh, there's a closer view of that house too. You guys. Did you hear that? Yeah. Guys, technically we're only supposed to be back here, so we're gonna be like Oh, there looks like there's an opening. We can get in there. That'd be nuts. We gotta be really, really, qu really, really quiet. Let me. I'm gonna pick, put you guys up there through this crack. Let me know if you see anything. <gasps> anything, guys? actually owned all this at one time comment down below what you think they use this barn for for horses cows pigs look at that guys there's the actual house yeah It's pretty neat. Guys, so I think what we're gonna do, we're gonna, there's a little trail over here that you guys can see right there. I think we're gonna walk down it and actually see if we can get a little closer to the actual golf house. But is that beautiful? Old. I know. I was hearing something. What's inside this shed? Junk. Probably junk. Yeah. You can tell it's really, really old too. Mm -hmm. Oh my god, a closer view. Hey, what does that sign say? Yeah. Horses. Was it horses? Peter, Peter F. Gall. So that's the name we need to keep out for. Yeah, show them the sign. Get closer. Sorry, camera's blurring out a little Guys, bit. Guys, that tells you how old this place is. 1865 and 1862. Are we? Go through that trail or no? I don't see any, but you never know. Almost it's to scare people. There's a closer view of that house you guys. See all the boarded up windows we were talking about? I mean, they even got the doors and everything. Like, they don't want nobody going home. It makes you wonder what's inside it. I mean, think about it, guys. Usually they do windows and stuff like that. That way people can't break the glass or anything. But they actually got the whole house sealed up. What's right. in there? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> like, even if we got permission, though, like, how would we even get in there? Unless they have like a secret board you push. Yeah. <laughs> I think this leads you all the way around. Uh, walk a little bit more. Maybe we can get a front view of that house too. That's just crazy how they got every, even the attic windows. I know.
it looks like it stopped. say help preserve the beauty I know Where? Oh. So that was that's how you act, enter, but we won't do it. Keep an eye out for us, you guys. See if anybody's coming. Is Peter Gall, are you here with us? I wonder if the boards have anything to do with it too, if they're trapped in. Hello? Hello? Is this Peter Gall? Are you trapped in the house? Is that where your spirit stayed? Really no, 
know, it makes you wonder if they're like trapped in there, but you can't like access it because of woods. All right, guys, we got a couple like yes and hellos, but uh, maybe we'll get more readings by the uh, actual cemetery. Yeah, some places you go to, like like uh, that abandoned building we did yesterday. You know, uh, I mean, we didn't we didn't know even know no history about it. Go in there, and next you know, stuff's getting thrown, dropped, voices. Um, you know, a voice actually repeated me when I told it that my name was Steve actually right afterwards just said Steve <laughs> so, I mean I mean okay. sometimes you get them sometimes you don't I wonder how old that is that like they were old mailbox no that's a bird Peter oh <laughs> I, don't want to walk that way. Hmm. I wanted to walk around it but I know that puts us out in the spot All right, you guys, we are going to sneak back out of here, <laughs> and we will pick up when we get to the cemetery. See you then. All right, you guys, we just arrived at the Gull Cemetery. Talk about a cold walk, guys. Yeah. This is cemetery closed, dust to dawn. That's what I was saying. Brandlin says 23 likes, guys, and we'll come here at night nighttime and actually see if the rumors are true about these balls of light on top of these great tombstones. 23,023 likes. <laughs> Did I say 23? Yeah. 20, well, yeah, definitely not 23. Let's do 23,000. I was like, wait, what? Too That's easy. too easy. That would be way too easy to set us up for All fire. right, so we know to look for Peter Gull's tombstone. Hopefully there's not a lot of Peters. We heard the whole family is actually buried inside the cemetery. Oh, I, don't, I don't know who would want to name all their kids, you know, that come in the world after a Peter. Yeah, there's Sarah Gall, Sarah George. It's like the whole family. Feel it. Is it warm? Yeah. Sorry, Sarah. It's cold. Cold? I don't know if it has to be a night thing, but if you guys smash that 23,000 likes. Might, it might be a 3 a.m. challenge thing. <laughs> That's kind of weird about this hump. I'm like scared to stand on that It's one. like something, somebody buried or something? I don't know. I don't want to find out. <laughs> that is weird. Jolid. I wonder what these empty spaces are. Is that like... Maybe somebody... It's a spot where somebody's going to have a tombstone put. I bet you because there's still family members living. So. Yeah. Different last names, but obviously related. Florence. Cemetery probably make a lot of money, though, man. Yeah. Quiet spots to be buried in. Feel that one. The George one, yeah. See if I. Uh, What's up, big George? How you doing, buddy? That one's colder than the other one. Really? Mm -hmm. That one actually was actually warm. Yeah, it is. That's weird. All right, guys. So we got we touched two black ones so far. Oh, don't want to step in there. Have you noticed? Well, it could have been weed whack too, mm -hmm. but that looks shorter than all the other grass. Yeah. Infant, infant, Harold George. Gall. Infant. I don't know. Mary Emily. Infant would almost, you know, be considered a little baby. Well, yeah, about four, five, six years old. But well, I mean, the years don't match up on that. Yeah. Got hair on the camera. <laughs> She's always either cleaning the lens off with you guys on there with her shirt. Or, or picking something off of it. Peter F. Born in France. I wonder if that's him. See, there's another Peter. Uh -huh. What year? Do you remember? Do you guys remember what year it said on the... Uh, on the building, that barn? Uh, it was 18, it said something about a horse was built in 1862, and then the barn was actually built in 1865. So my guess is what they're meaning by horses, maybe they had horses, started getting horses at 1862, and then built the barn in 1865. So, see, there's so many, was it Peter F. Gull? All right, you guys, we're going to end this for a second. We're going to check back on our video and see what the middle name was.
Hey, the video was too long. I didn't feel like going through the whole footage. Uh, we'll just keep looking. That one says George. Emily. Ooh, feel that one. Oh. Really? Oh, that's pretty neat. Look at that, you guys. They got a fancy one. That one ain't really cold. I say the coldest one was the gall one. Mm -hmm. That one right there, George. Bonnie. Ooh, feel this one. Are they? This one ain't really cold either. <clears throat> that one's Bonnie. She's still alive. She's old. 1934. Well, she got buried and they never put the end date on there. Maybe they didn't know when she died. But that would be a little weird. She'd be old one. Yeah. <coughs> Gall. Catherine. George. Lois, Elizabeth. <laughs> What's that one? Rest in peace, Impton baby. Oh, baby. Do you guys know what the word Impton? Impton. Impton means. Comment below, unless you know. <laughs> Yeah. I wonder why these ones are so dull compared to the other ones. Probably just cheaper tombstones that you couldn't afford. Yeah, true. That one looks like it's starting to break. John Arkell, John G, John G. Francis. So far we only found two uh, Peters. Allison. Is that gray or is that black? That's not black. That's, That's gray. gray. Guys, and she's colorblind. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> There's only a couple more black ones. Yeah. I'm not seeing another Peter. I mean, you gotta think it might be a night thing. This kind of like a black one. Is it? And they said it was supposed to be warm or cold. Supposed to be warm to the touch. Warm to the touch. Yeah. There's a lot of Lois's in the family. And George's. It's like all the all the guys. Hey, sorry about that you guys. Battery died again. I don't know if we just have bad luck with our camera dying. Probably. <laughs> Cause I feel like it's every video that happens. We got one more black tombstone we're gonna feel, which is recently seems like they just put this one in. That might be a younger picture of her. And then when she got older. That one's cold too. Got an angel. Ooh, this one's fancy too. Look at this. This one has deer too. See what these signs say and then we'll uh, head back and do a reading on it. Gull Cemetery. June 24th, 1836. Peter F. That's what his name was. 
Peter F. Yeah, but there's two of them. Yeah, and then their two-year-old son, junior, Peter F. Jr. P Peter F. Jr. and then a Peter F. So it's one of those two. Old yeah. Ones. Did you remember if it said? Um, it didn't say Jr. I don't think. Yeah. Oh, it's the same sign, you guys. All right, let's go do a reading. Let's see what old Peter <laughs> has to say, huh? What if we got like a really clear voice? Uh, I so we know where he definitely is. Yeah. Well, that's what that's. I, I think, truthfully, they say that they actually haunt this actual cemetery. Yeah, because of the uh, and the woods surrounding it. Not the. So they pretty much left the house and was yeah, like, "I'm going to protect over my family." I mean, they originally died in these woods because they got kicked out of their house. So why would they think, as a spirit, that they're allowed to go back there? Very true. Very true. All right, let's see if we can find what one is the original Peter F. Yes. Which we Peter can probably F. tell by the dates. Marine. So. Catherine, his wife. So that's Junior. Mm -hmm. That one. And then that one's... 18. Yep. 26. Alright, so we're just going to do this one, guys. Did you see? It doesn't have, like, a... That's what I was looking at. That don't make no sense. Unless, when they died off, they didn't know what year. Yeah, good possibility. It's really weird. I mean, I don't know. Is Peter F. Gall here with us today. If Peter F. Gall is here with us, could you come up to my device in my hand and say hello? Hello, can you hear it? Yeah. Hello, my name is Steve. We came here to visit you guys today, all the Gall family. What'd that say? Sound like I said I know. Is it true? Is it true about the rumors about you guys dying off one by one in the surrounding woods? We were at your house. You had some beautiful land. I sound like I tried to say thank you. Is, uh, are you here guarding over your family? Yeah. Yes. Oh my god, it's clear as day. We heard that your son that passed away at two years old. You guys? Is it true that you guys all got kicked out of your guys' home that you lived in? And town? You can come as close as you want to this device so we can hear you a little better. Did you say yes? Peter F. Gall, if you are here, could you come up and say something in this device? Could you do something to let us know that you're actually here? You got more reading in your hand. I think you're stepping on it. <laughs> Sorry. I don't know if it's very, 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 you're stepping on it. Sorry, Peter F. Gall. Did you hear that? Yeah. Yeah, you got more readings in your hands. Peter F. Gall, are you standing by me and Brandilyn right now? 
That sounded like a different voice. <laughs> is this Peter F. Jr. or is this Peter F. Sr.? Can you say your name? Peter F. Ball, are you here with us today? If so, could you come up to this device in my hand and say hello? Hello. That was clear. So are you here? He's like, you cut us off. <laughs> so are you here with us then? Yes or no? We're not here to cause no harm, we just want to communicate with you. It sounds like you said I'm dead. A little bit, yeah. Did you say you are dead? Yes or no? Show us that you're here. Maybe uh, say my name. Could you say Steve? Can I say Steve? I think so. Did you just say my name? Yes or no? Did you say Steve? That sounds like a girl. Maybe Mary Ann? Is Mary Ann here with us? Your wife, is she here with us, Mary Ann? Seems like you didn't live a very long life. It's pretty sad what happened to you guys. All you guys try to do is live a good life and people end up kicking you out of your hometown. Does it make you sad? Yeah. Okay, well, we'll let you rest in peace here, buddy. It was nice talking to you. Marie? Yeah. See you guys later. Can you say bye? Does that sound like a bye? I don't know. A little bit, yeah. All right, bye, you guys. guys. <laughs> At least at the same time. So we did get some readings. Um, it sounded like they were trying to communicate with us. Um, I mean, if I had to say this place is haunted, um, obviously. We're probably gonna get most of the scary stuff at nighttime, but we also do like to come to these places during the day, so we do see the surroundings, and obviously you can see the sign when we walk up here that you're not allowed here. So smash those 23 likes. Subscribe. Comment below. And definitely turn on those notifications so you get all our updated videos. Hope you guys enjoy the venture with us. See you next time.